Hi everyone, it's Reptile Awareness Day today and the reptile team would like to celebrate by sending you some fun facts about some of our favourite reptile species here at Colchester Zoo. Hi everybody, I'm Fran. I'm here with two of our island, Solomon Island skinks that are right here behind me. These are the largest species of skinks known. They can reach a length of 81 centimeters from nose to tip of the tail. The tails are prehensile and the female will carry the, ba the developing babies in the belly, nourishing them with a placenta, unlike most reptiles. And after six to eight months, they will give birth to one lizard. This is Talibo. He's one of our two male Komodo dragons here at Colchester Zoo. They're a really special reptile because they are the world's largest lizard and they have a unique hunting style which with their venomous bite means that they can take prey as large as water buffalo. We're really lucky to have a pair of endangered Virgin iguanas. We have successfully bred six lizards with the young, being immediately easy to tell apart from their coloration. As you can see from our adult male, he has striking blue and green bands compared to the completely green females. Behind me you can see Bernard, he's one of our two green anacondas here at the zoo. Green anacondas are amazing because they are a semi-aquatic snake. They spend a lot of time submerged in the water and they're perfectly adapted for this with having their nostrils positioned just on the top of their head so they can stay totally under the water while still being able to breathe. Hello everybody, I'm here with Hector, a yellow imaginated box turtle who's right here next to me, having a big yawn. Many people think it's a baby because it's so tiny, but this is actually his adult size. Yellow imaginated box turtles will hibernate during winter, so Hector likes to dig a little hole for himself when it gets too cold, and every five or six days it will pop his head out to ask for food. Behind me we have Caroline, who's our slender snouted crocodile. Now, slender snouted crocodiles are a really, really special species of reptile because they are critically endangered in the wild. And this is mostly because of fragmentation of their wild habitats. She has her snout pointing out through a leaf at the moment, thinking that she's really well camouflaged. But these snouts are really specialised, meaning that she can hunt for small fish in really murky waters.